guys, Coach Scott, High Rep Athletics here. Today we're going to be talking about mobility. Uh, some of our torture devices, some TP therapy tools. We have our rollers, a soleus, gastrox roller. There are TP balls, the cross ball, double lacrosse ball, rope, jump stretch bands. We use a uh, rumble roller, we use a TP uh, therapy roller, just a traditional foam roller. Um, goal for today is just to talk about endurance, uh, athlete mobility. Uh, so really targeting you know, the big three, I'll call them, uh, hitting that uh, hip flexor, open up those hip rotators, and really working on some type of rolling, uh, open up that fascia a little bit. First one I'm going to show you, the big one over here, is uh, the wall stretch. So we're working on this quad. What we really want to do is open up this hip flexor so this iliopsoas gets really tight, especially for our um, athletes sitting at a desk all day, they're in this position. Get really short hip flexors. Um, we're going to get them up against the wall. So what you're going to do is you're going to park yourself uh, right up against this glass here. We're going to come knee down, start in this quadruped, up on all fours. Get this knee all the way up against that up against that wall. And you're going to work from this quadruped position. We're going to be working our way up. So we're going to come up one knee, come up here, stretching out this here. Keep our chest nice and nice and in line. We don't want big belly coming out here. Working this iliopsoas. Then what we want to do is get our brain involved a little bit. We're going to squeeze this butt, fire this glute, press forward. All right, pressing this hip forward. We're going to spend three, four minutes there. All right. Now when we want to target those rotators of that hip, we're going to come out here on the side. If we have a band, we can use it. If not, we're going to stay in this quadruped position. We're going to. So if I'm working on my right hip, I'm going to kick this leg in, block it with my other leg. All right. My first goal here is to drive it laterally out to the side. So I'm going to be kicking it out to the side, placing my weight on it, pushing the head of this femur to the back of the capsule, driving over, and I'm just going to kind of scour in there, find some nasty spots, and just try to work them out. Again, three, four minutes here. If I can add a band to it, all right, we're going to place that, that band in here. We're going to get that in here. We're just going to use this band to help us uh, push that capsule out a little bit, all right? So pull here, we've got that femur out against that capsule. Again, lateral, it's helping us get lateral. And then we're pushing into those corners here, cleaning, cleaning up some of those tissues. So that's hip rotator. Next one we're going to work on, some foam rolling. All right. Work on that IT band, work on that quad, work on those hamstrings. All right. Nothing fancy here, you can't go wrong foam rolling. We're going to spend some time here, clean up the length of that. IT band, we really want to make sure that we're targeting where that iliotibial band kind of hooks into our uh, biceps femoris, that lateral hamstring. We want to clean some of that up between that interface and as well between this vastus lateralis and this IT band. We're going to spend some time on that angle, really breaking up that interface. Awesome for our, our runners that tend to run in one plane. All right? And we're just going to get, we can go anterior with this. We can cross one leg over. All right, really work from that length of that, um, all the way from just above that patella, all the way up to our hip. Can't go wrong there as well. Spend a few minutes on that. Get a little fancier, get in there a little bit deeper. You can go with this instead of that foam roller. We also have our, our um, TP therapy. All right, same thing, IT band. We can get in there, roll, nice, great tool. Gets in there nice and deep, works on it pretty well. All right. One other thing I want to show you is just like a attack and floss piece. All right. And again, this is uh, all inspired by um, K-Star Mobility Wad. I am uh, not the originator of this stuff. He definitely, uh, I'm, but I'm okay with stealing it. He does some good stuff, so we'll give K-Star credit. Uh, so attack and floss. Hamstring. What we want to do is want to get this up into some of this tissue here. Block this here if I'm working lateral hamstring, high hamstring issue. I uh, come here, roll my weight onto it, and then get some joint, you know, get some uh, movement in the joint to get those muscles working around that restriction or around that tender spot, trying to break up some of those adhesions there. We can work up, we can work down. So we can work that in a seated position. We can also get this in a supine position, really clean it up around this uh, distal quad, right around this patella. Get this here, come on over. Clean that up, get some flexion in there. You feel some good crunching and grinding in there. So that's our tack and flow. All right, just a couple tools for our endurance athletes. Um, 
you know, pick a torture device, pick your poison. I rep athletics.